नीट क्लियर नहीं हुआ इसलिए यूक्रेन चले गए अगर पढ़ना ही था तो इंडिया के मेडिकल कॉलेजेस में पढ़ लेते यहाँ कॉलेजेस की कमी थोड़ी है दीज आर सम ऑफ द कमेंट्स दैट इंडियन स्टूडेंट्स आर हियरिंग हुए जस्ट रिटर्न फ्रॉम यूक्रेन मेजोरिटी ऑफ देम आर स्टूडेंट्स हु हैड गॉन देयर टू स्टडी मेडिसिन This whole evacuation process and the controversies have shed light on why some students decide to study medicine outside India. If these students have gone out, is the reason behind it that they lack merit or they do not like Indian education system? The answer is probably none of these two options. To understand this issue better, we need to look at the data provided by Ministry of External Affairs in the Parliament. It says that there are over 11 lakh 33 thousand Indian students in 99 countries across the world. Of all these countries, Canada, the US, and UAE are the most favored destination. In Ukraine alone, over 18 thousand students are enrolled, and over 16 thousand students were enrolled in Russia. But there is something special about medical students that this data does not show. The National Testing Agency conduct all India pre-medical entrance test for students who wish to pursue MBBS and BDS in Indian colleges. According to this agency, over 16 lakh students registered for this exam in the year 2021. Of this, nearly 8.7 lakh students qualified. But do you know the number of MBBS seats? Just close to 90 thousand. Let that sink in. This means that only 10% of those who qualified in the exam actually get these seats. But is there be a very big hole? Not all these seats are in government colleges. This means that affordable seats are less in number. Nearly 50% of these total seats are in private colleges. Of this 50%, fees for some of the seats are capped, but for the rest of these seats, the cost can be astonishingly high. It can be somewhere between 50 lakhs to 1 crore. that is the cost of becoming a doctor in india from a private medical college now let us look at the cost in ukraine for odessa national medical university the tuition cost is close to 25 lakh rupees for the entire course it is same for many colleges across ukraine and in many other countries we had even posed this question to a student who has just returned from ukraine after evacuation and this is what he said ki humme tak sunne mein aata hai ki humne wahan pe jaane ka decide kyun kiya kyunki aap jante hain ki yahan pe admission lena medical mein kitna mushkil hai agar aapka number bhi aa jata hai to ya to kafi cheezon ke karan aapka admission nahi ho pata hai yahan pe ye reason hota hai ki hum jaise log fir choose karte hain country like ukraine ho gaya uske jaise koi small countries ho gayi yahan pe medical karna yahan ke private college se actually thoda sasta hai but even then the path to become a doctor in india is not easy After getting the degree abroad these graduates have to appear for foreign medical graduates examination or FMGE the pass percentage for this test is abysmally low according to a news report over 24% of students could clear this exam last year only 17% of those who came from ukraine could qualify to practice as a doctor in india let's put it into perspective lakhs of students go out of india to study various courses together they spend crores of rupees contributing to the economy of the foreign countries and when they come back as it happens in case of many medical graduates they do not even qualify to practice as doctors in india at least in majority of cases so before we blame these students let us look at our own country and the government that leave them with no option just imagine how india's medical infrastructure and doctors availability can change if we have enough affordable medical colleges in india itself and clearly the answer to this problem is not ensuring that private medical colleges are there but to ensure that government colleges are there with affordable fees what do you think about this let me know in the comment section and if you like this video do not forget to drop in a like and subscribe to india times